Hello everybody, welcome back. Today we are going to configure SPI on layer 3 switch along with the VLANs and test the connectivity between the two different VLANs. We just have taken a layer 3 switch and connected to virtual PC1 and PC2. Let's go ahead and configure IP address and default gateways on these PCs. We are on a virtual PC1 now. Let's change the name to IT team, okay? And for setting the IP address, we can use the command IP 10.0.0.0. .0 .0 10 it slash 24 for the subnet mask and uh, the default gateway 10.0.0.1 we can also verify the same using the command show ip and that will display the ip address the default subnet mask or uh, whatever the subnet mask you have configured here. That's what you will see here. And uh, the gateway IP address. So this gateway IP address is the one that we will be configuring on our multi-layer switch. Okay, so we are done with the configuration in virtual PC1. Let's move on to virtual PC2. Let's change the name from VPC2 to, to the HR, okay? And for configuration of IP address, IP 192.168.0.10. And we have given 20 slash 24 and hence 255.255.255.0 for the default gateway 192.168.0.1 show IP you can see the IP address and the default gateway has been assigned. Okay, now let's configure the ports. The ports connecting to these PCs will be always switch port access and respective VLAN. So let's move to the switch. Configuration. Interface Ethernet 0 slash 0. This is always switch port access. Switch port access VLAN 10. Similarly, we have another port here, Ethernet 0 slash 1 for the VLAN 20. So let's take interface Ethernet 0 slash 1, switch port mode access, switch port access, VLAN 20. Now, don't forget to enable IP routing on the switch. IP routing, because we will be configuring the IP address for the VLAN 1 and VLAN, sorry, VLAN 10 and for the VLAN 20, okay? So enable IP routing. You can also say no IP CEF because we'll be pinging from the VLAN 10 to VLAN 20. Configure. Let's configure our interface VLAN. 
10. IP address. So this is always the default gateway. That's what we are going to configure for our SVI. So what is the default gateway for the VLAN 10 here for this PC? It's 10.0.0.1. Okay, and slash 24 is the subnet mask. No shit. Okay, so we have one more interface. It is interface VLAN 20. IP address. This is the default gateway here, right? So it's 192.168.1. 0 0.1 slash 24 for the subnet mask. Okay, no shut. Let's verify with the command show IP interface brief. You can see the IP address has been assigned for the VLAN 10 and VLAN 20 and the status is up. Okay, so now we are done with the configuration on the multi-layer switch and we have enabled the IP routing. Okay, so let's ping from the VLAN 10 to VLAN 20 and see if that works. I'm on a VPC one, which is our IT team. So let's ping the VLAN 20 IP address that is 192.168.0.1. Okay, that worked. And similarly, we can test from the HR team to IT team and see if that works. So ping and IP address is here um, on the IT VLAN that is 10.0.0.10. And that worked. Okay, so this completes the lab about switched virtual interface on the layer three device. I hope that this video has been helpful to you all. Please don't forget to subscribe and see you in the next video.